Good morning, everybody. Um, it's been a few days, so um, you know, just checking in. Hope everybody's uh, oh, hoping everybody's doing well. Um, I uh, want to give uh, brief thoughts about um, you know, about the about the Rangers. Uh, I know it's been a few days. Um, Got to talk about that ugly six to one loss to the Buffalo Sabers on Thursday. Um, Am I going to sit here and, 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 and push a panic button? Nah, I'm not going to do that. Am I going to sit here and declare the season over? I can't. It's only, it's what, 11 games out of 82? I mean, they're 8-3-1. and one. But here's the thing. Here's one thing I, I'm concerned about. Two things. One is they're in fourth in the Metro Division. Why? Because it looks like the Capitals are taking the next step. The Devils are taking the next step. And the Hurricanes are actually still pretty... Um, you know, the, uh, they're pretty good. The Capitals, Devils, and Hurricanes. So that's one reason is the competition in the division looks to be pretty tight again. Um, and two, the defense is awful. Um, I mean, I noticed it when I, a few weeks ago when they played the Utah, uh, hockey club when, um, when I'm sure they'll eventually get a name, but. Um, the first, uh, their home opener, they, it was sloppy, ugly hockey. I mean, Keandre Miller, I'm, I, I'm okay if they let him go. He, uh, he doesn't use his body. He uses his stick and he, and he just, um, he, he doesn't really show a lot of forechecking ability. Um, he tends to flail at the puck. He tends to rely on a stick and I think he gets beat very easily. I think he turns the puck over a lot and I'm not a fan of Keandre Miller's game and, uh, Jacob Truba, uh, it's like the polar opposite with him. He relies too much on his, uh, his body and, um, I just, they're out of position. They, they, they're, they're sloppy. They just don't, um, I don't know if it's coaching or if it's the players or if it's both, but. I mean, those are two defensemen that you have to call out if you're a Ranger fan. And and Adam Fox is also more of an offensive-minded defenseman, um, which is great. Um, I think the only really true, solid core defenseman the Rangers have is Lindgren, like core to the defense. Um, maybe you ought to give these young guys a shot like Mancini. Maybe Zach Jones needs a shot. Uh, Truba, I'm... Um, um, he, once he leaves, I won't miss him at all. I don't. I just. I don't think he's. Eh, I don't know. I, I'm. I'm kind of souring on him because he may, he's been making too many mistakes lately. And um, and as far as the offense goes, I mean, I would say uh, Panarin's regular season. Panarin, of course, he's going to do his thing. Um, what's Trocheck looks okay. Kreider looks eh. What's happening to Mika? I think he we're sitting, we're beginning to see the, we're seeing the beginning of the decline for Mika Zibanejad. So um, I don't know. I mean, I'm not panicking. I mean, there's lots of time left, and I think these guys know this is the last chance they have to try to get something done before the core has to has to break up. Um, is this team uh, making the playoffs? I'm sure they'll make the playoffs, but. Um, are they a cup contender? With if they don't fix their defensive woes, they're not going to be. I mean, honestly, they won't even sniff the conference finals like they have two out of the last three years if they don't fix this defensive crap. So, um, and also Laviolette tinkered with the lines, and maybe you need to give Rempe back in there to, for just a shot of energy because the teams looks like they've been they were just going through the motions against Buffalo. Um, long season, um, but it's there's some alarm there. I'm not one to just, you know, say, oh, this team's uh, dead in the water, nor am I one to say, oh, this team's going all the way. I, I, I But I'm, I'm just saying there's concern here. Um, are, are we seeing the beginning of the end of this core group, or it's just it's a little blip and then they'll get it figured out? I, I don't know. Um, may need to tinker with the line. May need to go back to the way the lines were. Maybe you need to, um, you know, when, I know we're ways away yet, but come March when the trade deadline is, Got to get a defenseman in here. You got to shake up the defense because the defense is absolute garbage right now. And uh, um, Igor can only do so much. And uh, that's another thing. There's rumors had it that he's, he's close to signing an extension. We'll see. I mean, uh, is he a great goalie? Yes. Do we have to? I do. I want us to break the bank for him and uh, um, you know sacrifice uh, other positions in need. Not necessarily. So 
Um, really bad, sloppy effort on Thursday. Um, got to get it cleaned up. Uh, and with the Rangers' history, honestly, if Peter Laviolette doesn't, at the very least, get back to the conference finals this year, maybe he goes and we bring in another one. I mean, the, the Rangers, uh, Dolan and Drury, haven't given a lot of leeway lately to coaches. So, see what happens. But, long way to go. 8-3-1. and one. Am I panicking? No. Am I concerned in spots of the roster? I am. See what happens. They play tonight at Detroit.